Rode has just announced two brand new products for smartphone filmmakers. If you're familiar with Rode, they have been making some absolutely fantastic microphones and interfaces, and I'm using them all the time, but now they're also dipping their toe into smartphone filmmaking. In this video, we're gonna take a closer look, so grab a cup of coffee and let's get started. Welcome back to the channel. In case you're new here, welcome. Super excited to have you. My name is Julian and I'm the creator of Smartphone Filmmaking Pro. On this channel, we talk about making better videos using our smartphone and we also show you how you can turn those skills into money. So in case that's interesting for you, make sure you hit that subscribe button. So Rode has announced two completely new products out of the blue, basically. And the first one is a MagSafe mount and we're gonna talk about that first in this video. And then secondly, we also have this Rode cage right here which is also very, very interesting. So I would say without any further ado, let's check out both products in detail. Let's see what they can do and let's find out if you should have them in your own toolkit. So first of all, we have this MagSafe mount, which is very interesting. Like when I was unboxing this, I didn't really know like what I'm going to do with that and how it actually is working. Because when you're unboxing that, you know, the first thing that you hold in your hand is this round thing right here and you don't really know like what you can do with that but basically it's super simple like you also get a bunch of aluminum sticks they're very well built and basically on the side of this um, round you know MagSafe thing here you're basically just have a couple of mounts and you can just put them in there in whatever order that you want you have these inserts on every way so you can basically just you know put them in however you want and then you just take your smartphone it is very important that you have a MagSafe smartphone because otherwise it's not going to work because this is solely based on MagSafe so my iPhone 15 Pro has MagSafe built in so I can just put it in here and now I have a thing that looks somewhat like this it does look a bit weird to be honest but once you understand like how Rode intended that you're going to use it I think it makes a lot more sense I'm um, with that one right here with this part at the bottom you have a quarter 20 screw and that means that you can mount this basically on any tripod for example so what i have right here this is basically just a mini table tripod and i can just screw that in here and then i already have like a really cool grip you know i can just hand hold it really nice like this and now i have two cold shoe mounts at the top and at the right here but like i said before i could also swap that out to put that over to the left for example if i wanted to and i'm just going to put that down for a moment and now let's talk about these two two accessories right here and what you can do with that. So one thing that is extremely important if you want to capture high quality video, and that is that you also capture high quality audio. The audio that I'm using right now is going through the Rodecaster, so it's also a Rode product. And like I said before, Rode has a bunch of different microphones. This one right here, for example, is the Rode VideoMic NTG. And this also has a hot shoe mount or a cold shoe mount. I can basically just screw that in right here, connected with the USB type C cable. And now I already have some awesome sound and you know if I'm filming myself for example if I'm doing a vlog style video then I have some very clean sound is you know it's out of frame I check that and you get some very clean audio because you're using a proper microphone and for example one more thing that you could be using with a setup like this is just be placing a small video light onto the other side because then once you're vlogging once you're you know going around you always have clean audio you have some great video coming from the iPhone for example and you also get some great lighting because you have a light built in basically or if you're swapping between using an on-camera microphone like the Rode Video NTG or you want to use like a wireless microphone system like the Rode Wireless Go, basically all you got to do, you know, you could also connect that instead of you know, instead of a light, for example, if you're filming outside on a bright sunny day, you won't need that anyways. And then, you know, depending if you're recording yourself or if you're, I don't know, recording a, a second person and they have a lavalier microphone, like you could also just swap the USB Type-C cable between the two and then you just have a very versatile setup. And like I said, before you know for example if you don't need that part right here just pull it out and then you just have a smaller setup or if you want to you know change the position and bring that up to the top like just plug it in it's just a very versatile setup and i can see like many vloggers that are going to be using that and yeah overall i think the design is nice super simple to use super lightweight so yeah if you can use that if you have a use case for that then definitely make sure to check this out and the second piece of equipment is this cage right here and this is also like this feels very solid i'm not sure but i think this is built out of aluminum and this cage all over the place has different mounting points you have you know three eighths uh, inch adapters you have 
quarter 20 screws you have cold shoe mounts basically all over the place you have a ton of mounting points like if you would use all of them that they are providing like you could literally be mounting like one two three four five different you know microphones like this for example so that is absolutely wild and how can you use that like let me just show you how that works real quick I'm just again taking the microphone that i have been using before put that in here at the top make sure that it fits nicely put that in and now i already again have some great sounding audio and something that is really cool like magsafe is always known to be working with iphones you know ever since the iphone 12 i think magsafe has been a thing but this right here this is the galaxy s24 ultra and the case that i have on here is the freewell case basically i already made a review about this and i'm not sure if it's the case that has the magnets built in or if it's the samsung 24 ultra itself but basically you know i'm just showing you right here like i can also use this cage with my samsung which is just really cool because i know not everybody is using an iphone and in case you have you know an s24 ultra that's still gonna capture some absolutely amazing and beautiful videos and you still have some opportunities to not only use that with iphones basically when it comes to the mounting options when it comes to the versatility it's very similar to the other magsafe mount that we have just talked about like you can basically just adapt it to your needs you can you know adapt it to whatever that you want one thing that i personally really like with the setup is the cage is very big and it's very nice to handhold you know with other cages you always need to attach a grip here onto the side and that is also cool but it makes the entire thing like very massive and i think one of the most important things when it comes to shooting with a smartphone is it should be run and gun and fast and simple to use and you know not super big because you know if i'm using a massive setup like i could be using a camera anyways another thing that i also think is really cool with this setup is at the corners at every corner there is a cable mount so basically whenever you have i don't know like a usb-c cable to connect the microphone to your smartphone or connect the lights to a power supply or whatever it is like at every corner you have some mounts basically where you can just put the cable through so you don't have cables all over the place and yeah that is basically it that's everything there is to say about this it's very versatile like whoever is using that setup is just gonna look a little different i personally what i really like with this specific setup that i have right here is that also allows me to use add-on lenses with this cage because there is no like built-in integration to you know screw in lenses for example because road doesn't have any lenses as of right now at least but with this case and with the setup that i have right here i could also be plugging in some add-on lenses so in case i want to shoot anamorphic or something like this like i do have all the flexibility in the world to use that and that's just something that is really cool because i can just modify and you know personalize the setup to my own needs and that's something that i personally really love so in case you want to check out any of these products, I will link both of them down below. Huge thanks also to Rode for sending this over my way. I am a huge fan of Rode. Like, I'm not going to lie, like the audio that you can hear right now and the audio that you have been hearing, like basically for the last four years on this YouTube channel, like 95% of everything has been recorded on Rode microphones. I also have a Rode NTG3. I have a Rodecaster Duo. Like the sound quality is just amazing. It's super easy to use, super versatile. Also the Rode Video NTG, with a smartphone with a camera like I'm using that all of the time so I can very much recommend that and I'm really happy that I'm now partnering up with Rode. I will link everything down below. Huge thanks again to Rode and in case you have not checked out our free webinar where I'm basically sharing with you our five-step process that we personally take to make multiple six figures creating silly content like this and also doing some agency business and check out the first link down below. Huge thanks for watching and I'll talk to you soon.